Welcome back. Just like with World 2, it happened again. Did not finish this temple on the last stream. We're gonna come to it on a fresh new day. Hopefully ready to beat it. And I really want to beat this one because A, I'm trying to show every level that I need to beat it. But also, World 5 is ahead of us and it's my favorite world. So I want to get there ASAP, so let's just beat this. Let's just beat this. Flat out, I was not looking at the screen. I should really do that. Alright, ready. Aim. Banana. Oh, oh. All right, so far so good. And now we walk, jump. I'm up here and I'm gonna jump over you. Yeah, I was, no, I tried to play it safe with, I keep thinking you can flip them over. That's not true. I should stop trying to do that. Okay, we'll just mow him over. And boom. Oh man, I was worried about that one. Not what I was trying to do. I just wanted to get the penguin off my back so that I could patiently work my way up here and over him. I forgot about the cannon part, jeez. I really don't find that climb to be too difficult. Continue down and narrowly avoid the spikes. Oh boy. That was around where I was dying the last time, too. So we need to work on that. And by we, I mean me. I don't know, maybe you at home need to work on it, too. I don't know how well you play this game or don't. Alright. Anyway, just being careful is my goal. Why I don't want to roll so much. Because that can take careful and turn it into careless very quickly. Go. Up and go. Jumping up. No dilly dally. No need for that puzzle piece. No need for bananas. Oh, how did I do that? <laughs> okay, I'm safe for a little while. If I just chill here, and by chill, I mean burn in the siren lava. Is this sinking? This is sinking. Fine, I will take the hit there if I need to. Now, am I sinking or is the lava rising? Shoot! Is what I did with that cannon. And I, mean, I made the shot, I just didn't make the hollow-up. And that's the furthest I've been since I originally played this game. I just want to remind people, if I can 100% this game on the Wii U, I can beat it on Switch. 
just not like that. All right, for the local recording, I'm gonna pause here and cut to a better attempt. Darn it. If you're watching the recorded version of this, there's gonna be a couple weird cuts there because I thought I had a good run. Yeah, I did. All right, I'm back in the lava area. Still only one heart. Oh, that's it. That's the end of the level. I was so close. And now I got it. Hooray for mysterious relics that we found in present boxes because the temple gods knew it was his birthday. How did they know that? I don't know. Thank you for the starfish. Alright, hard part's over. <laughs> Let's go to the best world in the game. The theme of this world is fruit, and it's very, very purple, and the purple-yellow color scheme on this screen is absolutely amazing. It's so beautiful. <laughs> Any moment now. There we go, the actual level. Look at all those grape like things. Return of Spiky Jones. I didn't do anything over here, so I guess I wasted that. <laughs> Whatever it was. Now we get to see a bit more what the snowmads are doing on these other islands. Not just DK Island that they took over. Now this island, they are very specifically running a fruit operation. We'll see different phases of it as we go through the world, and I love it. The fruit makes everything so colorful, and the factory stuff makes for some decent obstacles. Out for those things. Did it again with the barrel. Where where was that barrel supposed to go anyway? Heck if I remember, here's a barrel. A barrel that'll do more than just roll away from me. Alright. Giving me a choice, I'm gonna go Diddy just for classic feeling, like, you know, Dixie is kinda still a better Diddy, but, you know, the old Donkey Diddy reunion is good every so often. Watch out for those slug bubbles. Oh now these guys. Bouncy, bouncy, bouncy. If I could do impressions, that would have been Jimmy from Ed, Ed and Eddie. But I can't do impressions, so that was not Jimmy from Ed, Ed and Eddie. Anytime a platformer 
incorporates bouncing, I generally have a good time with it. And that goes, for me, that goes all the way back to Pac-Man World 2. Which is a game I played on this channel some time ago. But I had audio issues during it, so... Up to you if that counts. But one of my favorite sections of that game is Bedouin Woods. Where they introduce all those trampolines that you butt bounce on. Is there a puzzle piece for getting these, or is the reward just the banana bunches? Eh, I missed one anyway, doesn't matter. I will stick with Diddy, but take the extra heart. Looking at something for a second. Okay. Got that slight pause. I'm a little worried about that spear you got there, buddy. Now these two fall over. I was not close enough to grab the vine up there. I was only trying to make the first one fall over, but you probably figured that out. We. I wonder if I could have made that with Dixie. Please respawn. Thank you. You're welcome, Steven. In other news, the weather here is very tropical and not very freeze, and I wish it was more freeze. I mean, I'm in an air-conditioned room, thankfully. Uh, it has been very, very hot. How do I keep doing that? I'm, I'm on the right side of the platform. <laughs> you need to stay to the right. Also, thank you for the bits. Okay, maybe I will pick Dixie this time. Just for proof that she is a better Diddy. Wait. Figures that time I didn't even need her. Okay, I know what you're thinking, but I swear I was holding the trigger button to grab that just didn't count. <laughs> Did I mention this is my favorite world in the game? I did, but I think I mentioned it before Steven showed up, so I'm repeating it. Okay, now you see how Dixie saved my hide right there. Is the best. And I'm gonna try not to use her as a meat shield this time. That was kind of a point contention in the last stream. Oh, Sally is here? Which battery? Duh. I should have paused the game. If I'm gonna look at chat, I should at least pause the game. Oop. Shove me. Duty. Look at that leaning tower of... What do you call them? Uh, they're not exactly durian. They are spiky fruit. Well. Oh. Why did I think I could land on those? Alright, uh, so... Uh, so a $5 tip, I'm sure they appreciate that. Yeah, it sounds like they must have been good at their job to warrant earning that. 
Because uh, typically, uh, typically five dollars is on the uh, larger side of tips. So yeah, gotta earn that time, mention. I didn't enter this cannon before. There's a bonus room. Yeah, I recently gave an increased tip to my barber last month, back when they were opening back up. Because I knew they were working extra long hours and extra days of the week just to try and catch up on the demand. And as always, thank you for the continued bit, Steven. All right, let's not get poked this time. I can time this right. Go, go, go. No, no, no. Go, go, go. No, no, no. Go, go, go. Yeah, that's exactly how you do it. Uh -huh, definitely the best way of doing it right there. I was perfect at that platform and challenge. I'm gonna wait, and then I'm gonna wait, W-E-I-G-H-T, to the right. Oh, you've gotta be kidding me. Dixie, help me fix that problem. That is the beauty of Dixie right there. Nice emote you got there with the unlock. That's my only one currently. I have to think of what other sorts of emotes I need one. Yeah, well, you know, they kind of have more references to work with. Like right now, the only thing I could work with is the whole I make puns thing. Maybe I should do a little more of that. Uh, let's see. Levels about fruit and we're bouncing. I'll just jump over here. That was bad timing. Hello, Archer. That's the last letter, so the end must be near. The end is nigh. Timing. Has anyone ever done a thing where they say the end is nigh, but then they show a picture of Bill Nye? The uh, the end is nigh, N Y E. I feel like that could be a meme. Oh boy, if this is the level I think it is. Reckless ride. We're gonna be ride and reckless loot. We're going through. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yep, it's a rocket barrel, and it's the level I'm thinking of. But first, obligatory bonus room. Ha <laughs> ha 
That's how you get the puzzle piece. Okay, so this rocket barrel level, special. They did something crazy with it. And we kind of saw it with the mine carts in World 4. But first, let's dodge some fruit. Get low. Get a little higher. And now we go semi 3D. Alright, oh, I missed the K. I gotta start over. I gotta crash and start over for the K. Ah, but we'll deal with that mech shortly. Once I get the K. Oh, yeah, the gimmick for this one is aside from having the fruits, the semi 3D perspective. Alright, stay low, the K is low. Oh my god, I wish I could get that heart, but I need the K. Never mind, I died anyway. How about those rainbows? Oh, oh my god, I did it again. A little higher, a little lower. Alright, now to deal with the mech. I guess we could kind of call this like a rocket barrel boss. You are dealing with an enemy. Uh, dodge, low, dodge, high, dodge, low again. Dodge, penguin. Now those penguins really look like they're having fun beating missiles. Yeah, I want that heart. Checkpoint, hooray, thanks for the other direct speed. Now we got back to 2D for a bit. Ah, there was a heart up there. That would have been nice. Shoot. At least we're here, at the checkpoint. Okay, dokie. Whoosh. Don't need the heart this time. Oh, what? Eee, what? We're so zoomed in. Uh, yeah, you slice that fruit, you. Secretly dodging the slicer. Uh, here come some more knives. They are ready to cut us like, like yesterday's fruit. Well, go down, I think. Now up. Oh, now down. Very down. Oh, you think you're gonna get me, huh? Oh, you hit your head. Cool. Thanks, Steven. I worked hard on it. It was like the third individual idea that I had. I finally worked. And I ranted about that over in the podcast section of the Discord if you want, like, the behind the scenes thought process. I've got some other pretty crazy ideas, but it's gonna take me some time to work on them, and of course, that gives me the chance to take a break from posting there. And other people and continue having their chances. I can't believe I failed that.
life. Source of all life. Helium. I missed the end. I feel like I did that on the Wii U, too. Let's go get that letter. Alright, back here, looking for the end, remember to shout Napoleon if you see it. <laughs> it's very important that you shout Napoleon. You may not think I mean it, but I mean- There's the end! I hope you shouted Napoleon because you should have seen the end. <laughs> Napoleon! I don't know how Napoleon would have felt about that death. Napoleon, I'm charging into battle for you! Oof. Wait, was Napoleon the general? No, wait. <laughs> don't say things that are gonna make you look stupid. You may be stupid, but you don't need people to... Alright, now to barrel through the rest of this level. Ha, ah, barrel. Maybe I should have grabbed that heart. You know what? I don't need the G, right? Because I got it the first time, it'll count, right? I hope so, or else I have to do this level a third time. And it on the balloon again. That doesn't count. I do have to do it all in one go, don't I? I guess that's a misconception I had. Third time's the charm. All four letters for real this time. Oh, look in the background there, by the way. Don't know if you noticed that before, but the pirate... <laughs> the pilot of the mech... Parrot shoots out and gets eaten by that thing in the background. And we're gonna have to deal with an enemy like that soon enough. Oh, Steven, you never have to apologize for running out of bits. Donations are completely optional. 